Hello everyone, my name is Robert Marzullo from Ramp Studio Comics and welcome to my course on digitally painting in Manga Studio 5, Working in Perspective. In this course you'll learn how to construct one, two, and three point perspective using the very powerful perspective guides inside of Manga Studio. As I walk you through the setup of the one, two, and three point perspective, we're going to first use some very basic examples. That way the focus is on the tools themselves and not so much on the art creation process yet. That'll come later, but you first need to understand how the tools work and how you can better make those work to your needs for your style of art. After we've covered the basics, we'll then get into the illustration. I start every illustration with a series of thumbnails or rough sketches to work through the concept. Then I'll show you how to take that concept and start the painting process. It'll be in a three-point perspective, and we'll use those tools to make the job a lot easier. I'll also be showing you how to use the groups and layers to better organize your work so that you can work through complex scenes like this efficiently and effectively. I've done a lot of client work over the years, and if you don't set up the work in just the right way, when the client wants to make changes, it becomes a struggle. So what I want to show you here is how you set up this scene, and with layers and groups, you can make edits really quickly. So I'll be showing you lots of ways to edit the work, lots of ways to implement small details and make changes to those details, and you'll work through the entire process with me. Almost the entire course is in real time, and the only areas that I've time-lapsed and narrated over top are areas where it's redundant. So you'll basically get to see it all in real time and work with me through that process so that you can really understand what goes into making this type of illustration. So by the end of this course, you'll have a lot greater understanding of how to construct a complex scene and also how to use the very powerful perspective rulers inside of Manga Studio 5 Clip Studio Paint. So I'm very excited to teach you this course, and I hope you're excited to learn it. Let's get started.